Hey guys, it's you, a man. Here's a clip coming out of Ontario, Canada of a black diamond uh, walnut-shaped craft moving slowly across the sky. Now, what this is is unknown. No sound, steady motion. Duration of event was about two minutes. I have run this through several color filters and I have enlarged it so that you can take a better look at it. Coming up at the end of the video will be three still shots. They're close-ups so you can get a look at the shape and the way it changes. If you like this video, hit that like button and subscribe. And remember to share us out to your social media platforms. And as always, I want to thank you for watching. En Paita, Ogni en Paita, se registra Ogni en Paita. Aquí estamos en la subida de TP, estamos en la subida de TP, estamos aquí esperando y se ha detectado un Ogni. Estamos acá con las bellezas. Allá está el Ogni, el Ogni. Este es el Ogni, eh. ya se va desapareciendo ya ahí. Hey guys, it's you, a man. Here's a clip coming out of Peru of a cylinder vehicle seen over a hill. Um, I have run it through many different colored filters so you can get good looks at it and take a look at its shape, size, and position. It doesn't seem to move. It seems to be hovering in one place. Um, it was filmed uh, at 5.53 p.m., on October 21st, 2021. Coming up are five still images that will give you a better look at it. They're all enlarged, so you can take a look. If you like the video, hit that like button and subscribe, and remember to share us out to social media platforms. And as always, thank you for watching. Hey guys, it's you, Apple Man. Here's a clip submitted by Justin A.D. Maynard of a UFO filmed over Adelaide, Australia in late 2018. Um, it is a bright red object with white lights embedded within it. Take a look. See how it morphs and changes shape. Um... The object is actually moving on its own. It is not a camera shift. So take a look. 
leave your comments down below and uh, coming up are four still shots where I've either brightened or diminished the amount of brightness so you can get a better look at the differentiation between the red and the white and how it changes. Um, I hope you enjoy the clip and if you do please hit that like button and subscribe and please remember to share us out to your social media platforms and as always thank you for watching. Hey guys, it's you of Man. Here we have a clip of a fast-moving disc-like object that disappears into low cloud cover outside of Toledo, Ohio on July 25th, 2020. Check it out. Uh, very clear until it disappears into the clouds and then reappears, drops down low, and disappears altogether. What do you think it is? Make an assessment and let me know. Coming up are three still shots. Along with several different filters, I have run this object through so you can get a better look. And as always, thank you for watching. Hey guys, it's you, UFO Man. Here's a black object filmed over Roswell, New Mexico on 9-27-2021. Here I've slowed it down by 0.25%. I have also brightened the footage so that you can see it better. There seems to be an energy field around the outside. Take a look, make an assessment, let me know what you think. Coming up, I have enlarged the footage by two times and I've run it through a colored filter so you can get a look at that energy field. It's kind of white right here. Um, coming up will be uh, three still shots which I've run through separate filters so you can uh, look at different colors and see how it brings out the field. Take a look, make an assessment, let me know what you think it is and as always thank you for watching. I'm on Glenstone in Springfield, Missouri. That is a cube spinning on an axis. Flickering. It's got lights around it. In the middle of the day. Hey guys, it's you, a man. Here we have a unique object. It is a cube spinning on its axis over Springfield, Missouri on 10 18 2021. It seems to have lights around it. When it moves really quickly, it seems to be two objects, although I think it's only one and the camera seems to be stretching out the image. What do you think? Make an assessment. Let me know what you think down below. Coming up, I will run this footage slower so you can take a better look at it. I have slowed it down by 0.50%. I have also brightened the image so you can get a better look at the lighting and the way it morphs. Also, coming up, 
There will also be some footage in a different colored filter for you to take a, a different look at it. And also four still images of the cube shape. So you can definitely know that it is indeed a cube. So as always, make an assessment. Let me know what you think down below in the comments. And thank you for watching. I'm on Glenstone in Springfield, Missouri. That is a cube spinning on an axis, flickering. It's got lights around it in the middle of the day.